Hi, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Thunder versus Pelicans NBA matchup on Wednesday, November 1st, 2023. Here on YouTube, I do tons of free pick videos, so be sure to subscribe to our channel. We do free picks every day, sportschatplace.com, pickdogs.com, right here on YouTube, as well as across social media and our live shows. And when you give out that many free picks, you're bound to like some games more than others. To find out which games those are, as well as to get best bets from the world's best handicappers, head on over to our website, pickdogs.com. Just click on the Premium Picks tab. While you're there, use the discount code PICK. You'll get 15% off all of your purchases of $19 or more. We now also have the Pick Dogs Dime Club and Sharp Trading Plays. These aren't meant for everyone. These are meant for people who make big bets. I make big bets. I know a lot of you guys make big bets. So call or text the number. You cannot get this on the website. The only way to get it is to call or text. But anyways, let's get to this one. OKC taking on the Pels. And I tell you, OKC bounced back from that loss to the Nuggets and uh, did some damage to the Pistons last time out. You know, I've been pretty high on the Pistons this year, and of course, we've been high on Thunder for quite some time. But the thing about the Pistons is, you know, they're kind of up and comer. So I thought that with the Thunder being favored in that game, it wasn't really a role that we're used to seeing the Thunder in. So I thought maybe, well, as a, as a favorite, maybe not the best place to be. I'll tell you what, it was a way better place to be than being on the Pistons that night because I didn't cash any ticket at all on that game, that's for sure. Shea had 32 points in that outing, and uh, G'day came in with 21, 19 for Williams, and Chet Holmgren kind of really getting himself involved now. Played 24 minutes, but we're talking about, you know, Webb Yama, a big guy that can shoot from the outside. Chet was 4 of 5 from beyond the arc in that game, just 4 of 5 from the floor. That was the only points that he scored outside of two for 2 from the charity stripe. So you got a big man that can shoot from the outside and hit free throws. Let's go Chet. On the other side of this one, we've got the New Orleans Pelicans. And of course, they've got the big guy in Zion Williamson. But as always, you know, will he play and how much will he play and all that stuff? Well, it was 29 minutes and 56 seconds and 19 points in that loss against the Warriors last time out. He turned the ball over five times in that game, had zero blocks and five personals. Man, when Steph is going off for 42 points, your only chance is for a guy like this to absolutely take over the game and go off. That's why he makes the big bucks. That's why he's counted on. That's why he's supposed to be the franchise guy. You're no franchise guy. What you are is a guy that just has come up way short because you hardly ever play. But when you do play, 19 points when Steph's putting 42 on you, that ain't going to get it done. We know Zion Williamson is probably capable of a lot more than that. But I just think for a guy that rarely ever plays, oh man, you know, when he does, he owes this team and he owes this fan base a lot more than that. CJ had 19 in that one. We love CJ, right? And I mean, Basically, at this point, it's almost really like it's his team. I just think that, um, you know, the Pelicans may be a little bit overrated um, still. You know, and with Zion in there, probably doubly overrated. I like them better without him in the lineup. I'm going to take OKC, and that's going to be my free pick. Of course, while you're doing your picks today, putting your bets in, be sure to use our free betting tools at sportschatplace.com. Our betting tools are 100% free, and the way they work, they show you just how often all the bets on the board today actually hit. Then they show you today's odds, and from there, you can assess the risk-reward, putting yourself on the bets that come in the most, pay the most. That's how you make money, betting on sports.